And then this is my everyday daily routine. I try to wake up at 530. The first thing that I do it's um, after I wake up, it's I recall my dreams and then pray and then I do the journal that I just showed you. And then I do the Wim Hof method. I like to meditate after that. I like to do three rounds of the Wim Hof and then 10 minutes of meditation if I can. But if not, um, I'm shooting for five every day. Uh, and then I do 10 minutes of visualization. And then I do my first workout of the day of 75 hard, which is 45 minutes of exercise. I then read and then I journal. So pretty much what I mean by journal is like setting up my to-do list and any important things that I have to do. At this time, I usually always do my um, my affirmations with this, so everything's like included. But um, business, I mean, it just varies, but it could either be posting on social media, posting on YouTube, recording, learning something about YouTube, anything of those things that will help me like, become better, then I do that. And then for my personal, it's um, if I can do all of this, in one day and I pretty much try to do all of my habits in one day then that's a great day like if I can do that that's great and then if I can learn one thing every day that's amazing if I can do one thing that sucks I love that because doing one thing that's uncomfortable every day it's it could be anything it could be you doing an extra rep or you pushing harder after you're tired or finishing the day after you're like super tired anything like if you can do one thing that sucks man that's how you build mental toughness in my opinion and that's what this whole journey is about building and creating mental toughness you know um so i do that this usually takes some um, well with the workout and stuff it takes me about two two and a half hours more or less um every day but I just see it as like, damn, those are two hours for me. And like nothing else matters between 5.30 and 7.30, 8 o'clock. Don't bother me. I'm doing me, you know. And then it doesn't always go like this. This is like the ideal situation. Obviously, like it rarely ever happens. Like in this, I mean, with this, within this time frame. But pretty much by 9 o'clock, I try to like leave my phone. I can just stop using it. And then I like to journal. Um, I like to write down every, like anything that I learn or anything that I can like improve on. And then I set up my wins. Like, did I complete this three things today? If I did, then that's great. And then I start um, praying and then I visualize. I like to read a little bit more in case I didn't read enough in the morning. Because, I mean, you do need... To read 10 pages a day but i usually try to read a little bit more just for my own well-being and then um not only that but i feel like reading late at night it does set me up in that mindset of like shutting up you know so i really like that and then um if possible this one's optional it's i meditate and that's pretty much the last thing that i do i usually well I usually floss first Cause that's um something that I really like. Cause flossing is like leaves me a clean mouth, and after that, it just becomes really easy to go to sleep earlier. And then if I can, I just try to meditate a little bit more, and that's kind of like how I take myself to go to sleep, you know. And then I try to be in bed by ten o'clock, and then so I can be asleep by ten thirty, because I do need those seven hours of sleep if I can. So yeah, man, this is pretty much what I do on a daily basis. Like I said, I'm really trying to build mental toughness and I'm trying to show you guys the process of what it looks like and what it feels like. So yeah, let's get it.